Hey guys, this is Smack here. Uh, <laughs> this is the first ever buzz cut direct video or premiere or whatever. Basically, I'm just gonna show you a bunch of shit, a bunch of proof of concept stuff, a bunch of random other stuff, some funnies, some laughs, uh, maybe some development footage for certain games we're working on. So yeah, I hope you all enjoy it. I'll I'll be back uh, in a few uh, in, in a f in just a few. Uh, so I'll see y'all uh, this uh, hold on. One second, where's my paper? Uh, this says that this uh, this says that the first. What does that say? One sec. One second. C can you like translate this for me? It's in fucking Swedish. You said you would. Um, this apparently says, uh, it's time for development footage. Please take a look. <laughs> hey guys, this is Smek. Uh, again. Uh, uh, fuck. Uh, this is Smek from the future where I've actually recorded the development footage. Uh, this is, uh, just a little peek at the innards of Buck Tuck and the Wrath of Doug Be Good. Uh, so it looks a little odd, uh, because there's all this random stuff everywhere, but have no fear, because, uh, it's actually, it actually works very well. We've got all the money picks, pickups over here, Buck Tuck has a bunch of sprites pinned onto him for, like, the animations that aren't, like, you know, part of his running animation set and jumping and stuff. Uh, we got, uh, the keycard and stuff. These use variables to, uh, tell if you're holding the keycard, uh, and the key. But, uh, yeah, there's multiple keys that are basically just say clones of each other. The chicken, uh, and, uh, the chicken is just called chicken. That's all you need to know about that. Uh, this is the, the sign that says the town is being quarantined because of terrible demons. Uh, if you're wondering what this pink splat is down here, that's what, uh, that's the, uh, particle effect that happens when you open up the locked doors. Um, and the brick up here is the particle effects for when you break the bricks. The, uh, we got the red blocks that switch when you destroy, when you set, uh, set up the C4. Uh, over here we have the moonshine, uh, which activates the wowee alcohol message that goes up through the heads-up display. The less of a moose message is right here. And here's our buddy Slug. You saw him in the intro and you're seeing him again. He's not used as of now, but he will be a uh, weapons shop owner uh, because he uh, he's my friend online, and he just he said, "Hey, can I be a weapons shop owner?" So, yep. Uh, we got the uh, heads-up display uh, for the pause menu with all the costumes here. Uh, we got ABC, all all that stuff. That's just a placeholder. Uh, we got the hicko meter. Uh, it, what? Uh, and we got the, all the stuff right here, um, yeah, and, uh, we got the background right here. It's, it's very, very, very easy and fun to program and make, uh, now that I've got everything laid out. And, yeah, it's very nice. We got the main menu over here with the one and only Buck Tuck, uh, and the ranking screen just has a bunch of videos layered onto it. Uh, and here's the story. And, uh, yeah, all, fun fact, all of the running sprites that appear behind Buck Tuck when he's running the trail are separate sprites each. Uh, and we got, uh, the darkness that appears when you destroy a dark soul enemy. I forget what these guys are called. Uh, somehow. They're just such forgettable enemies. Uh, but, uh, we got an unusual marine dude up here that was gonna be used for a cutscene, but he ended up never being used. And we got the, uh, destroyed house, little ba bleh, background object. We got the root beer, which is, uh, identified as root beer in the game's code. We got, uh, 
uh, the hot dogs, which are identified as hoagies in the game's code. And that's about all I have to show you for now. Maybe in a future video or direct, I'll show you the rest of the stuff that I may have or may not have developed. But, uh, yeah. Thanks for, uh, watching this quick segment. I'm back. Uh, I know y'all probably don't like that, because you don't like me. But, yeah, we're back. Uh, uh, just for a little... I I'm just gonna talk to y'all for a little bit. I have not recorded any of the development footage. Uh, well, as of recording this video that you're watching right here, this part of the video, I have not recorded any of the development footage yet, so I'm just gonna say something like, Damn, that sure was some good development footage. Uh, uh, yeah. Hope you liked the development footage. Is that all we had to show them? It's not all that. Please tell me that wasn't all we had to show them. That was, uh, was the development footage all we had to show them? No? Listen, motherfucker, if you don't show more development footage, everyone's gonna be so pissed off, dude. This was- this is- this is motherfucking- this is supposed to be some hyped up shit, and you're just saying that the development footage was all we had to show them? Oh, thank god. Okay, uh... Um... Uh... I can't say that shit. I can't fucking say that! We'll be right back. Alright, and we're back. Now, it's time for some not development footage, sneak previews of certain things, you know. And, uh, also, uh, we're gonna have a little sort of, uh, we're gonna have a interview with the developer of, uh, Buck Tuck, also known as me, so I'm just gonna be interviewing myself. Yeah, uh... Rob? Why am I interviewing myself? You, could, you couldn't just get someone else to come on the fucking stage and just interview me for me? I have to interview myself? Alright, I'll make do with what we have. Alright, fine. Bye. Yep, I'm gonna be interviewing myself. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot. Uh, please take a look at the sneak previews of stuff. Take- go. <laughs> What's up, everyone? My name is Smek, uh, and here is a uh, sort of sneak peek for uh, Trash Bag Redemption's engine as well as a uh, all sneak peek for uh, a Dead Rising remake that is possibly in the works. But uh, yeah, uh, so far uh, we've got uh, basically 3D movement all down and stuff. Uh, Doors kind of work. Uh, gun work. Uh, a health bar has been implemented to the engine, and also a experience point meter, also known as a prestige meter, has been implemented. That's really all there is to show. But uh. There is, uh, there's just like, you know, there's gonna be some, a lot of changes when Trash Bag Redemption actually comes out. For instance, uh, these textures will all be replaced by the time, uh, it comes out to be more copyright friendly, as these are all Sims 2 DS textures. So, yeah. This has been a sneak peek of. The engine and also a Dead Rising remake. I'll see you in the next sneak peek. Hello, everyone. Welcome to a sneak preview of Doom Dimensional Destruction. Now, this has been a project, basically, my first ever Construct uh, 2 project. Uh, it was sort of left to rot after the buck tuck was begun. So, I just want to pay my respects to it and give a little sneak peek. Uh, because why not? As you can see, we've got a nice sort of animated menu here with all these gameplay of Doom and Free Doom in the background. I think you can pretty much figure out what this is going to be about. So... 
Like, now we've only got the first level started. I actually had to fix the animation cycle to work with Construct 3. But we've got the door code. It's leet, basically. Uh, let's go here. Type in the password. There we go. The door is gone, and we get, we're free to go. Uh, let's get the emergency exit trap door code. AGM93. But, what happens if we get caught? Let's see what happens if the camera sees us. We have to start all over again. That's, ba that's basically all there is to it, uh, but it's pretty substantial, kinda. Uh, so, I might work on it after everything else is complete. Thank y'all for watching this sneak preview. I'm back! Yay! Uh, uh, yeah, it's time for the interview with myself. Uh, the, let's see here. First one is, uh, what inspired you to make Buck Tuck? Pizza Tower. It's very simple. It's just, just Pizza Tower. Um, how were you inspired to make the character of Buck Tuck? Uh, now this is gonna be a long story. I saw a video by Cringe Post Randy on Instagram of this dude wearing a hat and he had like a tank top and, and he had like a, the trucker hat thing on the trucker hat style going on and he had like weird like tufts of hair going out the side and it just looked like he was like bald it just looked like he seemed like he was bald uh, and I was like that'd be a good idea for a character so that's what I did. That's like a good design, huh? Uh, and then another one here is- I'm gonna fall over. This- this chair- can we get another chair? Can we get a- I said can we get another chair? Okay! Uh... Jesus, fine, man! I told you we should've gotten another chair! Uh... Let's see. Another question. Yeah, I forgot that I was doing the questions. Uh, is there another page of this? Okay, here. Great fucking idea putting the pages on the floor in no particular order, so I can't find them. Great, guys. Uh, we got... I can't answer this one. I, I just can't answer it. Like, it's not... This is just a drawing, a shitty drawing of... Of Doom Eternal, but bad. I, I can't read that. I don't. I don't. I don't want to describe it. Okay. Does anyone here, in this in this studio, in this room, have any idea what a sane person thinks like? Like, oh, oh, oh get the chair. Oh, make it wobbly. Uh, uh, don't give him any script whatsoever. Make him describe a fucking drawing. I don't want to do that. Never show me fucking respect in this place. Oh yeah, I forgot. I just remembered something. A new custom action figure corner video should be coming up. This one with a much higher budget than all the others. So stay tuned for that, fellas. I don't even know anymore. Fuck off. Yeah. Yeah. Are you fucking serious? Excuse me. Excuse me. L l uh, stop. 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 Talk. Stop talking. Can you can you cut the video? Can you guys cut the video? Can you can you cut the video? We don't want this in the stream. We don't want this in the die die die. No, I'm not fired. Fuck you. Okay, buddy, buddy, buddy. Listen, I think you may have forgotten something here. I'm the fucking CEO of this company. Okay, I'm the CEO of Buzzcut Interactive. I'm Smacky Boy. Did you forget who you were fucking talking to? Listen, you can't fire me. I started this company. I own it, for fuck's sake. I swear to God. Oh, oh you, you're gonna have me forcefully removed from the premises if I don't stop, huh? Yeah, well, guess what, motherfucker? What? Do you think he knows that it's a fake shotgun? G guess what? I, I, will, I will come to your house. I will get you. I will fucking get you. Okay? Okay, okay, alright, we're on good terms now. Jeez. 
Okay, oh, no, don't hang up yet. Don't hang up yet. It's not, oh, sorry, I forgot that you're the CEO. Oh, yeah, bye. It's not that. I just, I want to say. Is the cam other cameras off yet? Can you turn off? Turn off the cameras, please. Listen. I just... You guys never show me respect in this fucking place. Like, I'm the CEO of the company. You should show me respect. But no, you don't even give me a script when I go out on stage into the studio fucking stage room and they start filming I don't know what to say you don't give me a script you just give me vague notions of hey yeah you should say this you should say that oh my god you yeah you what's your name what's what Gus Gus yeah Gus could you uh could you like uh what what is uh what is Rob like w what's his department You forgot. You okay, Gus, uh, I want you to find his office, and I want you to take everything out of it and just throw it out the window. Literally, I want you to just dump it out the window. I don't care if it hits any passers-by. We don't want Rob in this company anymore. Get him out. Get, get him out. Get him out. I said get him out. I guess you heard all of that, right? Yeah, 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 we're, we're, we're evicting you from the fucking company, bitch. <laughs> Alright. Alright, okay. Wait, don't do it yet. You're gonna have 24 hours before we fire you and throw all your belongings that you have in your office out the window. Uh, unless... Unless you take over game development for the next year. And, and you, you better not, like, be fucking slacking off and doing shit like that. You better fucking... The cameras are still rolling. Fuck it, I'll do it myself. I really hope they cut all that out. Hey guys, we're back. Uh, I didn't say to do it now. I didn't say to do it now. He still has like 24 hours left. Can you cut that out? Can you like cut this part out and post? Cut this part out and post. Yeah, that was the uh, that, that was the buzz cut direct. I hope you all enjoyed. Have a great uh, rest of the day. Have a very safe and productive day. See ya.